Hi, my name is Joe Dinnifer. Let me hit a couple of forehands and I'll show you what we're doing today. That was off center. I could feel that one. That was more on center. That was off center. Statistically, the average player hits off center, slightly out of the sweet spot, more often than they hit in the sweet spot. It's really a scary statistic when you think about it. And this is what causes vibration on the arm. This is what effectively makes us miss a lot of shots. The balls spray. We lose a lot more points and we are therefore less happy as tennis players. We have a solution. It's a great new training aid and it's called the Sweet Spot Trainer. Here it is. You might have wondered, what's he holding in his hand while he's playing? So it just simply slides down over the handle right it's got two velcro catches slides over any frame like that very simple and as you can see what's exposed here we go let me just take the velcro off and you'll see two pieces of velcro just strap in strap in and what's exposed is the sweet spot and it's got a foam ring around it so you feel it deflects the ball you can feel if you hit way off center and get the neoprene it's got holes in it and there are two major uses for this number one a warm-up tool so it adds a little bit of resistance and we all know that people like to warm up just like baseball players who put weights on their bat to warm up and then when you take it off you're gonna feel like you're swinging faster why because you are because it changes your what's called the dynamic stereotype by going through adding a little resistance and then removing it but the main purpose of the sweet spot trainer is to help you focus more on hitting in the center of percussion on the racket so let's see how I do hitting the ball hopefully more often in the middle and here we go so we're tossing and that was sweet tossing that was sweet. Let me hit off center now. Oh boy! And I felt that even more pronounced than I would had it not been here. But I'll tell you, psychologically, you put this in a player's hands. If you're a coach or if you're a player, you try it and you'll be zooming in much more in the sweet spot area. It may not be as easy as you think, but try it and you'll like it. Here's how to use it. You hit five, six, seven, eight, maybe ten balls with it in there, and you try to zoom in on your point of contact. Zoom in on your point of contact. Zoom in on your point of contact. Then you remove the training aid. This is called fading. And once you get used to it, you take it away, and without the sweet spot trainer, you go to hitting regular balls again and you find that with the right attention on the contact point your point of contact you'll start hitting that ball like a pro thanks for joining us and please feel free to forward the sweet spot trainer just to your friends if you've got someone you don't want to lose to make sure you don't forward it to them thanks for joining us